get a couple of hits here. And I have to get two from the tall, though. So you know, you know the ion's probably going to hit. That'll do it. That's one. Now you've got to get it here. You either need two more hits or a crit. I said there's one crit. Let's see what the lock brings. Oh my god! Well, I'll get through. What is it? A damage sensory. Well, that does fuck all because he's probably dead anyway. You were hoping for blinded pilot. Minor explosion or direct hit, or weapon malfunction. Now you just hope his next this shot here does shit. And it's very interesting whether he goes for that Tala or goes for Dutch. If it was me, ugh, I think I'd just go for the Tala. Because you know Jake can probably just finish off Dutch on his own. You gotta wear down that filler. He gets two. On Dutch, and that's it. Ugh. Now this absolutely has to be a kill shot. Here. Probably will be, but... Yep. Another hit and a crit. God. Hmm. Yeah. Not to take anything away from Paul, like I said at the beginning. Probably the consensus best player alive, but I think he's definitely had an advantage of dice in this game. And, uh, yeah, there's not a whole lot you can do here if you're Juan. I think this is probably going to be a two right turn from Jake. Probably just going to see a one left bank or a one straight here. Uh, I don't know. 
Two left bank or two left turn. Tough call. Bandit's probably, I would just probably three right bank it. Two right bank would be really close. But you gotta, you gotta just go hard at Jake, I think, and just try to get lucky, basically. Three right turn. So clearly that means he thinks Juan's gonna two bank. And a two forward. Ooh. That'll be close. Oh. Well, so he decides he's not going to go for a Jake, but Jake does go for the two turn, and I think that'll make it. Uh, yep, and that will probably be all she wrote. You're going to see a focus roll right, and a target lock, and a Big time shot on that bandit. Three on two. Ouch. Man, there have been so many times when Juan has just rolled blank, blank, or blank, blank, blank. There's been like two times when you rolled double blanks, and like three times when you rolled uh, triple, or I'm sorry, two. There's two or three times when you rolled double blanks, and one time when you rolled triple blanks. Has not got the dice. Especially, they've been especially unforgiving on D. Now, they're probably going to play it out, but... This is really just concede at this point. It's pretty much over.
Hmm. So, I'm not super familiar with all these guys, but I would say probably Paul Morgan, Theorist, and maybe Kinetic, I would probably say are the four best players in the field, I feel like, anyway. It's all really close. All great players. But... Yeah, Kelvin and Froggy's really on the bubble, and now Juan's kind of down there, too, at two and four. And the bottom two are getting either knocked out. I don't really like that. I mean, I understand. Whoever's putting it together, you can do whatever the hell you want, but I would think it should be the bottom four should have to play against four other guys, I feel like. Because he's... The schedule is so long, it's 12 weeks. That's freaking almost three months. So, I'd rather it... They at least offered the chance for other guys who are, have shown their capability to try to get in there. And now, especially now with the Galactic... I mean, I think once the Galactic Cup takes off, I think they're going to have to put this on hold, I feel like. Because a lot of these guys, like Paul, for example, he's got a family. Can't really, doesn't have time to get on and play two games a week, I don't think. Maybe. He just has to put his game club on hold, I suppose. But, yeah, this is probably it. All right, just call it. Come on. Good Morgan Lucy lost to Tex. Hmm. So Tex is really in the driver's seat now. Let's beat Juan, Kelvin, Theorist, Morgan, and Sideslip. So him and Paul is going to be a monster matchup. Morgan beat Froggies, beat Kinetic. Beat Moan. Lost to Tex. I'm sure everyone's looking forward to that rematch, too. Be super interesting. I would love it if they just played the same two builds they played from Worlds and just did it all over again. That would be something... Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 